Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. Uh, in this video, we are going to see about uh, how to make a Android TV app uh, by using a Flutter. So, without any delay, let's get started. So, if you want to uh, run run our application on, uh, especially on uh, Android Smart TV, uh, we must declare some configuration file which is uh, inside our Android manifest file. So, here I'm using the user feature for lean back thing. So, we must use this thing and uh, after that we have to give the touch screen as a required faults and uh, as well as for lean back software and uh, as well as if you want to release the apk for internet thing you have to give the permission internet and after that uh, here we have to give the banner thing for uh, since in tv there will be a big icon for to display for the application so we have to create it as a 320 cross 180 ratio for the app icon so that will be called as a banner for uh, tv apps and uh, the more important thing we have to include this uh, intent filter called the lean back launcher this will enable us to run our application on tv and this will tell the uh, google play store to enable the tv option for our application and that's it so these are all the things that we want to include in our android manifest file and we'll see in the dot side so yeah so uh, make sure that you have wrapped with your uh, material wrap with the uh, shortcuts widget and inside the shortcuts you have to give set the local key set as a like this and after that you will be activate intent and uh, so this will uh, what this will exactly do is like uh, for tv apps there is a uh, only one main thing that we want to take care of the main thing is a navigation since we don't we are not doing with it our uh, hands so it will be like all with our remote so that's the toughest part in our the tv apps when you are going to make it so we have to handle those shortcuts which is why we are using this shortcut widget by using by using the logic keyboard key as a select so this will represent the on the keyboard itself yeah so after that here i'm having a certain amount of images and uh, yeah, i'll be having a grid view here and uh, inside the grid view i'm just putting our images and i'll be using display the image dot network by using those urls inside the card and uh, whenever the user click on the card it will be uh, navigating to the detail class which is defined below so here i'm just passing the exact url from the grid view and uh, here that will be showing here and we'll be having the app bar called detail and the back button will be shown here in the app bar as well too so as i said before the important thing is the navigation since we are doing in the remote and uh, uh, it also like uh, adopt with the remote shortcuts so that's why we are using the shortcut thing here don't forget to do that so then only it will be enabling those shortcuts in your application so that user can use it within within the remote so that's it guys so that's all that we have to do inside our uh, flutter android thing so now we'll see the output i'll be showing the video on the tv so it will be recorded on my mobile phone so i will just attach with that uh, you can have a look at that so here we go So that's all for the today's video guys, we'll see you next video, stay tuned.